This is a cam follower that I often use to turn the heads on my automata. Quite a complicated shape. Not just for the sake of it though, it does have a purpose. The uh, cam's follower support holds there so it rotates like this. It's got a loop over there because an axle goes through there for one of the other axles. It then has a protruding part there because the cam wants to it wants to ride up and down over the cam without scraping against it. A roller fits in this part. And then on the end we have a weight to go because the blade fell. And here we have the, the part where the control rod goes. So you have the cam follower that goes up and down but the control rod goes backwards and forwards horizontally so you change the direction of the force. As I say, I usually those, use these to turn heads. A few design issues, uh, mainly about strength. The grain goes this way, so the part with the weight on it, that's fine, that's very strong. But we've got an issue with particularly this part here that goes down to the support, because the grain is actually going straight across, which is the weakest it can be really on the thin part. I overcome this by making them in two halves, gluing them together. And then the slightly different grain direction there makes them more than twice as strong. So then you've got a good strong part. The other thing we have to be careful of is where the roller fits in, because there, of course, there's only one section of wood each side. And it's quite thin, it's about two mils. Reasonably strong, but I like to make absolutely certain. So I, Plane down some, and this is about one and a half mil thick beech wood, and then I cut these out on a small laser cutter, and they will just glue over those ends there. So then you've got the grain going in two directions, which gives a very strong piece of wood for the roller to fit in. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, if you subscribe or like, that encourages me greatly. Uh, also, uh, on my website, you can find a plan that you can use uh, simple tools to make your own automaton and also as a base for making your own designs. You'll also find a lot of information about my other automata.